Hi students. Yesterday we discussed what is a bar graph and how to represent the given data using bar graph. Today I am going to explain a different type of bar graph that is known as double bar graph. Okay. So I am going to explain double bar graph with an example. See the example here. I have taken birth and death rate in nineteen ninety nine of different states. The data is related to birth and death rates of different states in 1999. If you take the Andhra Pradesh, birth rate is 22 and the death rate is 8. Karnataka, birth rate is 22 and the death rate is 8. Tamil Nadu, the birth rate is 19, death rate is 8. Kerala, the birth rate is 18 and the death rate is 6. Maharashtra, birth rate is 21, death rate is 8. In Varissa, the birth rate is 24 and death rate is 11. We have to represent this data using double bar graph. For that, I have taken a bar graph. I have taken a double bar graph on the graph paper. So, what are the steps we need to follow? First, we have to take x axis and y axis. On the x axis, I have taken names of the states given in the data. On the y axis, I am going to take birth rate and death rate. Now, if you see the birth rate and death rate, the highest number is 24. As I don't have 24 squares here on the y-axis, here I need to go for a scale, suitable scale. Here I am taking E square as 2 units. So I can represent 24 easily on the graph paper. Okay, next. So here next step what? The width of each bar should be same. So I am taking width of each bar is 1 unit only. And after each bar, we have to give equal gap between the bars. Here also, I am leaving one unit between each double bar. Right? Okay. Now, how to take? Under this birth rate is 22. Here, I am taking the birth rate with the blue color and death rate with the red color. See here, birth rate 22 while the death rate 8 is represented with the red color. Now, I gave one unit gap. And again, I have chosen the state Karnataka. Birth rate 22, death rate 8. 22 blue color birth rate and red one represents death rate 8. Next state, Tamil Nadu, which is birth rate is 19 and death rate is what? 8. Coming to the next state, Kerala, the birth rate is what? 18 and the death rate is 6. Now, Maharashtra, the birth rate is 21 and the death rate is what? 8. Next, Coming to Varisa, the birth rate is what 24 highest one and the death rate is 11. Okay. In this way, we are writing the birth rate and death rate in different bars which are lying side by side. That's why it is known as double bar. The bars which represent birth and death are lying side by side. That's why it is known as double bar. And the rules and conditions while drawing a bar graph, what we are following will be same here. Width of each bar should be same and the gap between each bar should be same. Okay. And suitable scale should be adapted to draw the double bar graph. Okay. Then double bar is useful to compare the two one, two items here, birth rate and death rate. By seeing this data, I can say that the birth rate is more in Varissa and death rate is less in what? Kerala. Okay. We can compare birth rate and death rate. Okay, this is a one of the type of bar graphs. Okay.